Hi, it's Michael from the Cognitive Group, and I'm joined by Chris. Hi there, everyone. My name is Chris Hunting Ford. I do dynamic CRM pre sales for Hitachi Solutions Europe. Cheers, Chris. And we're here today to talk a little bit about Chris's CRM journey. What initially attracted you to CRM? Well, it's a bit of a weird story. Um, I quite like working with anyone that deals in any sort of CRM space, which is customer relationship management. The reason is because we're all kind of consumers, we all use stuff, we all visit restaurants, we're all dealing with people all the time. And I'd like to kind of understand why people treat people in a certain manner and the software behind helping people do that. So initially that's what really brought me into the CRM game. And I think it's been taken a whole lot further than that now, you know. How have you seen the CRM market change over the years? Well, that's actually a really good question. Um, over the years, it kind of was always about just the customer. So customer relationship management, which obviously is still the most important thing today and your customers drive income. But I think it's moved away a little bit from not just customer relationship, but any type of relationship management. And, you know, in the market at the moment, you're dealing with not just customers, it's drivers, vehicles, properties, tenants, mm -hmm. all sorts of different units that you could have a relationship with from a CRM point of view and how you treat those specific units. So I think it's moved away from just CRM to sort of XRM, which is any kind of relationship management. And obviously for us, that's quite important. We need to understand all about these different industries and how they all work. What are the current initiatives you're working on with Hitachi Solutions at the moment? Well, so we actually are working on a number of initiatives, um, typically enterprise size. Uh, these are within the various industries that we focus on, uh, like professional services, financial services, and retail and public sector. Interestingly enough, we're even doing some stuff in legal. Now, within these uh, industries, we use most of the dynamic stack. So things like Microsoft Field Services, um, the Microsoft Portals application, which was previously ADX Studio, okay. um, the new functionality, which is Microsoft Project Service Automation, mm -hmm. which has actually just come out, and then finally Microsoft Power BI to kind of overlay all of it with reporting. The other thing that we focus on is integration to um, financial systems, in specific Microsoft AX, which is part okay. of the Dynamics family. Now that's quite important to us and important to the delivery of these enterprise solutions. And what are you most excited about? Well, I'd say the real me really loves the social components. I'm a massive social user, as most people know. Um, <laughs> I just think that it's a, it's a wonderful platform for gauging you know, sentiments and understanding brand perceptions um, of what people are saying about you on the web. Yeah. That's using Microsoft Social Engagement, which is integrated out the box with Dynamics CRM. Um, the one thing that's quite important there is being able to take non-transactional data and convert it to something transactional and actually take that through a process. Mm -hmm. So typically you wouldn't report on how many negative tweets you're getting, well now you can. Yeah. The other thing is also bringing um, things like web and chat and uh, telephony into it where it's all kind of in one place rather than having all these disparate systems all over the place. Mm -hmm. That makes sense. Cool. Yeah. Well, thanks ever so much for that, Chris. Pleasure. Ha, 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 ha.